Former CNN host Don Lemon is starting a new show on Monday. His first episode, an interview with Elon Musk. Lemon's show is going to have some sort of business partnership with the social media platform X. Until Musk texted Lemon, contract is canceled just hours after that interview. Don Lemon sat down with his old network to discuss what happened. Uh, it, it was interesting because at the end, I could tell that he was upset and he was uncomfortable. It was tense. You and I do not agree on much, yeah. but I will fight for your right as, to be able to say what you want to say. That's what freedom of speech means to me. And 24 hours later then? And 24 hours later. It means comes. freedom of speech does not mean, I guess, the same thing to him as it does to me. In his statement, X says the partnership cancellation is not an issue of free speech. X is not restricting the show or banning it from the platform. A post from X Business says in part, X is a platform that champions free speech. The Don Lemon Show is welcome to publish its content on X without censorship. However, like any enterprise, we reserve the right to make decisions about our business partnerships. Not only did Don Lemon go on CNN following news of the severed deal, but he posted on social media about how tense that interview with Elon Musk was, alluding to maybe something was said during the back and forth that triggered Musk to pull the plug on the partnership. Hi everyone, Elon Musk is mad at me. But apparently, free speech absolutism doesn't apply when it comes to questions about him from people like me. What did we talk about? Why is he so upset? Does he even have a reason to be upset? Don Lemon released some clips from the interview. In them, Lemon doesn't shy away from bringing up controversial issues. Everything from hate speech and who Musk plans to vote for to Musk's use of ketamine. Do you believe that X and you have some responsibility to moderate hate speech on the platform? That you wouldn't have to answer these questions from reporters about the Great Replacement Theory as it relates I to I don't Democrats, have to answer these questions. The Great Replacement Theory as it relates to Jewish people, do you think that? I don't have to answer questions from reporters. Don, the only reason I'm doing this interview is because you're on the X platform and you asked for it. Mm -hmm. uh, otherwise, I would not do interview with this interview. So you don't think, you, do you think that you wouldn't get in trouble or you wouldn't be criticized for these things? I'm or criticized that there constantly, was... I could care less. Sources who spoke with CNN say Don Lemon technically had not inked a contract with X, but they claim contracts don't necessarily have to be signed to be legally binding. A spokesperson for Lemon told CNN Don has a deal with X and expects to be paid for it, saying if they have to go to court, they will.